in the cold light of morning, with few comforts and with empty stomachs. It's time for the young to face another day. Cedric's the leader at 15, then the twins, Kaba and DQ, age just eight. They pass school children fortunate enough to be going the other way. Two hours later, they make it here, joining the ranks of the child laborers at Ruashi Mines. They toil alongside fully grown men. It's all unofficial, but highly organized. Our trio work as a team. Their first job, sifting away the dirt from nuggets of copper. Heavy work, especially for DQ. He tells me he's never been to school, but he wants to go. I'd like to be like children in Europe, he says. They go to school. I saw them on a TV. But my father can't pay my school fees. That's why my life is so hard. A few steps away, other young boys, like DQ, forage in the dirt. The older ones get paid more, so many of the organizers here prefer to use a child.